We, the people, are the most critical asset of an organization. Every second, hundreds of decisions are made to attract, engage, develop, and retain human resources in organizations. Managers have historically relied on judgment, intuition, experience, and beliefs to make these decisions that impact lives and businesses. But how can we make more informed decisions to optimize the value of the individual's contribution, to stop wasting human capabilities, to improve the personal organization fit and achieve business benefits? Well, my thesis is about investigating the new discipline of human resource analytics or people analytics, which enables managers to apply statistical techniques to HR and other data to make better decisions about investments in people. Even though HR analytics is increasingly seen as a must-have capability in large organizations, little is known about how companies are actually implementing HR analytics and the degree of success they are having with it. To address this gap, I am conducting a mixed method research, including survey-based insights and interviews with HR analytics leaders and managers. The results of the qualitative inquiry revealed some promising examples of mutuality, where companies use HR analytics to build win-win outcomes that offer a better employee experience and improve the efficiency and effectiveness of operational issues. In a pharmaceutical company, the HR analytics team deployed an algorithm that identifies skills gaps and similarities across roles. The managers then deployed personalized training practices and customized performance appraisals in relation to each employee's development goals. By better marrying the skill needs of organizations and the personal development of employees, HR analytics makes the company a better performer and a more attractive place to work. Now, in an airline company, the HR analytics team deployed a predictive analytics model based on machine learning, which led to a 10% reduction in employees on call while maintaining the same operational level. This generated several million dollars in savings each year and improved the employee experience because being on call is disruptive to work-life balance. Building on the potential of HR analytics to help organizations reach better alignment with the interests of employees and generate business benefits, the next stage of this research aims to determine the extent to which organizations can systematically foster mutuality and achieve competitive advantage through the use of HR analytics. Now, imagine a business world where every HR decision strengthens the ties and alleviates the trade-offs between employees and organizations, where employees get personalized working experiences that enable them to better deploy their capabilities and reach their full potential, and where companies sparkle with a unique human resource advantage that helps them win in the marketplace.